Hello everyone, welcome back to another video, and exactly a year ago I made the very first jumper guide of 2023, so I've decided to do it again for 2024, because you know, there's a lot, of, lot, still a lot of people asking me um, what is the best route to go, and you know, how to make a jumper in general. So the first thing I'm going to say is, in, I don't know how long it is actually, 9 days, yeah, 9 days, uh, on the 21st of December I will be streaming, um, basically going from zero to a hundred thousand power in the first hour um, of being a jumper because that's when my jumper starts so if you want to join my jumper link in the description down below and also my discord is under there as well my link description what the my link to my discord in the description if you're a jumper or you are a um, leader or a recruiter you can post it into my channels um, in my discord as long as it's in the jumper group one there's around 40 posts per, like, 5 hours on there. So you'll definitely find a jumper group there, and your jumper group will definitely get noticed. So, let us go straight into it. The first thing, um, oh, by the way, before I start, I am now monetized. You can, you can now become members of my channel, so if you want to support me, you can definitely do that by clicking on, on the join, um, subscribe, net next to the subscribe button. Um, you can become a member, um, or you can donate or whatever, but yeah, let's go straight into it. So, the first thing you want to do is get this screen. Now, to get this screen, you'll need an old account um, that's been left for about 30 days. Um, this will be easy if you started a random account about 30 days ago or a year ago. You'll definitely get this, and it'll, it, should, it should just come straight up. Um, if it hasn't, then I will show you where it'll come up. Oh Lord, come! <laughs> it will exactly come up right here. It'll come up in the top corner, right there. And you go down, and it'll be a, a new journey. You'll click that, and you'll get those rewards to help you out. Now, let's just go through everything you'll need to know about a jumper, which is um, you'll need to know the civilization, um, the best route to go, the jumper groups, everything like that. So. The first thing I, I would advise I'd give is jumper groups. Now, I have just shouted out a jumper group, um, which I think, sorry from Polly, <laughs> which I think is probably the best one um, that I am in right now. It's called Scarlet Empire. Um, the link in the description for that. But you need to, you need to know what the best jumper group is. Um, so to find the best jumper group, I'd say is go on their advertisements rather on my Discord or Chiskul's Discord, um, you'll say it'll say like I don't know three main alliances, all that stuff. I'd recommend going with a jumper group that has two main alliances, because um, it'll just be easier instead of handling three or four. Um, I'd, I'd also recommend going for a three hundred member group, um, a four hundred member group, and that's it. And the reason being is not all four hundred, five hundred of you can get into the same kingdom, so. 350 is probably the max you could go so try and find a jumper group that has that um find a jumper group that has like you know r4 positions available um you know all that like not really requirements for free to play and pay to win like find ones that have like free to play and pay to win friendly um speak to the leaders see how you think um then choose your one from there but I also recommend Scarlet Empire because that's what I, that's exactly what I did, and I found these to be the best one. So, again, link in the description for both. So, first thing, um, yes, I'm on my 58 mil. It doesn't really help um, in terms of um, jumping, but I'm going to show you guys the best thing of jumping. Now, the first thing I'm going to think about when you when you've got your jumper group, you started like, what do you do now? Um, the first thing you want to do is obviously upgrade your buildings. Now, upgrading your buildings, do not spend any speed ups at all. Take about two days, probably, of just building. Um, you know, get into that max level 7, get every single building to level 7. You should be around 20,000 to 30,000 power by then, which is pretty decent on your first two days. But if you want to up that, um, I will have a live stream on the 21st where you can watch me like live um, 
go up to 100k power in like an hour. So, free to play as well. If you're free to play. <laughs> anyway, the first thing that you want, you probably want to know is your civilization. Now, civilization, there's loads you can choose from, like I said last year. <laughs> um, again, um, I've still, still got a little bit of a buff against Britain. Don't like it at all, really. Um, you might want the training speed, but it's not the olden days now. We're, we're, we're past Britain. It's now, it always has been China. You want that building speed? Um, always. You always want that building speed. You don't want training because you're not going to be training much anyway unless you want to go to 600,000 power for absolutely no reason and waste all your speed ups. Then you probably want to go Britain. But um, for the free to players out there, you'd want to go China. Um, simply because of the building speed, like I said. And plus, you get the best commander in KFK1. So, of course, you want to go for Sun Tzu. Well, China. So, that's, that's your civilization choice. Now, when you upgrade your city halls, you'll get hit 10 of him. Um, um, skill wise, if you don't know what skills are, I will show you quickly. Um, from, oh my god, come on. From here, Sun Tzu, you'll get his skills up and 10 each. So, it should take you to around about 51111. If you carry it on with the universal head, so you can get a max probably before your final kingdom or just in your final kingdom. Now, leveling them up is probably one of the easiest things. Um, if you get Martel right off the bat, fair enough, go and level him up. But you want to upgrade your primary first. So, primary, it can rather be Charles Martel, it can be Sun Tzu. But I recommend Charles Martel, really, because. If you get him 5111 before Final Kingdom, damn, like, that's really good. But at the same time, you want to save your gold heads. If you save your gold heads, you get YSG. Um, on this account, I have YSG maxed right here. This is what he does. Um, best AoE commander I can possibly think of for KFK 1, 2, and 3. Um, no, 2 actually, because 3 now, now you can get these, which is weird, but okay. Um, don't go for Richard. Personally, I would not go for Richard at all. Um... You're wasting your, you're wasting stuff. You, you're wasting your gold heads, really. Um, unless you use them for bad chain and then K, okay, but you don't need them at all. Charles Martel and Sun Tzu is probably the best picks. Now, if I was to do a tier list of what you would do when jumping, I'd go Charles Martel, Sun Tzu, um, Boudica, Bear Bars, um, or Bear Bars, uh, Meth Med, uh, that's probably it, to be honest. Bijan. Um, yeah, that's probably it. I mean, you could use Imater, you could use Pelagos, Herman, they're, they're pretty bad, to be honest. Uigi, really bad. Osman, pretty bad. CPO, pretty bad. So, if you want to go straight into the KVK1 matches, you'd go Charles Martel and Sun Tzu, unless you get Charles Martel and YSG. So, yeah, that's probably the best picks right here, these two. Now, that, that, that's Commander's side out. Um, how to get your 100k power, but I'm going to teach you guys on the 21st. Easy. Whatever commander you get, you need to level up to level 10. Um, but make sure you're focused on one commander um, for level 20, level 30, level 40, level 50, level 60. Um, but get every single commander, like him, him, him. You most likely to get these. Not here, not her at all. You most likely to get her. Like, you know, these, these gold commanders you're going to get, you're most likely going to get. So make sure you level up to level 10. You could get Meth Med, you could get Tao Tao, you could get Charles Martel. Get him to level 10. And you'll obviously get um, F-Led as well. So if you... Well, let, let's say you want 100k power right now. What are you going to do? Now, training troops. Um, you can train troops, but just make sure it's 200 at a time, I think. No, it's 300 at a time for um, T1. Um, well, for level 7. Uh, make sure you train only 300 at a time, which you can anyway, which you can't go over. And just absolutely spam it. Don't spend any speed ups. You can spend training speed ups because you don't really need them um, as much. Make sure you're doing your VIP shops because that's most important as well. And genuinely, that's pretty much it in these days. Um, <laughs> there's a lot to do. Um, obviously, you got your low has. You probably got low has in your drumba, um, I assume. Um, so make sure you do that as well. And also, one big one that really helps you out and you get about 3 million XP off it is not that one. It is not that one either. It is, it is this one. So, this won't be the same for you. It'll, it'll say explore. So, zoom out, press explore, and you can see pretty much every single village. These villages give you around about 
Okay, I, I get a map. Um, you'll get kingdom maps. Um, oh, you get these, but not in 10k. I get 10k? Wow. Um, I'm in KVK right now, so I can't really show the best of it. You get troops, you get uh, 1000 XP, you get the 500 XPs. Um, yeah, so that's pretty much what you get. And also, you can get your tech up as well. Um, for tech, let's have a look at tech. Um, obviously, mine's max, but obviously, yours won't be. Um, where's tech in this? Oh, it's there. Um, you can only do up to this in your jumper groups, um, jumping stage, but do not level any of them up. <laughs> Why? Because you can get them for free. You can get them for free by going and collecting those villages. So get this one, one, that one, one, and then these should be opened. Leave them. Go and collect your villages when you are level 7 or everything's maxed except your tech. And boom, there you go. So once you've done all that, you should be around about 150,000 power by now. Um, if you wonder where I got that number from, it's pretty easy. So again, I am streaming on the 21st. If you want to go see how I do it, please do come and support the stream and follow my footsteps. They're really, really easy. Um, I know my jumper group will be doing it as well. So if you want to join my jumper, again, link in the description. It's going to be great. So um, monuments, you can't collect in jumpers. Um, what else is there to say, really? Uh, there's a lot. <laughs> um, obviously, get your wall maxed. Yeah, that's pretty much it. So after you've got everything maxed, it should take you about two days to get every, absolutely everything maxed. So two days. You're two days in. You've got seven days left. Or six days left, as I should say. Um, and your jumper group's not jumping in six days yet. So, you're level 7, everything's maxed. You've got commanders up to level 10. If you get more commanders, get them to level 10 as well. Now, you focus on your main commander. Your main commander, as I said, should be Charles Martel or Sun Tzu. If you're an infantry player, if you're a cavalry player, it should be Bell Bars. Do not touch... Do not touch Versarius. <laughs> Please, do not. If you, if you if you max him, you're a fan killer, really. <laughs> so, you need Charles Martel or Sun Tzu. Um, if you want to be the, the value person that goes and says, oh, this is no value to me, you know, all that BS, then okay, go Boudicca. But you're not going to get anywhere. <laughs> so keep on them two. Um, it should be all right. Uh, get Elfled maxed eventually in KVK1, you should be fine. So, here we go. That is everything I have to say for the jumper stage. If you're a low spender, I can do a little, a little low spender thing right now. King's Coronation, boom, done. Um, obviously, on this one, I haven't, I haven't touched any of these, surprisingly. So, it has little icons now. That's good. So, get the ones that have the books straight away. There you go. Get, get the ones that have the books for low spender. Get the ones that have the arrows for low, low spender. Do not touch this one. Um, but yes, there you go. That is all I have to say for the jumper group guide. If you want to join my group, my jumper group, it's linked in the description. Um, if you want to join my server so you can advertise or even find yourself a jumper, link in the description as well. But yeah, you guys enjoyed that. It's been really fun making it, for sure. Um, make sure you subscribe. We are so close to 2K. It's, it's getting there. So make sure you subscribe. Um, and also, if you want to join members, um, 